were you? Mel? Yeah. And what the hell are you doing in my flat? Hiding. Right, you're Callum's daughter, aren't you? Yeah. And you're going to help me, otherwise we'll both be killed. <laughs> no, no, no. You're not dragging me into this. You used to work with my dad a few years ago. He said I could trust you. If you're stupid enough to come here, they'll already be following you, won't they? Yeah, which is why I'm here. You're going to get me to Dover. <sighs> well, what the hell did you do? See, I went to see Ray, get some information about my dad. Turns out, Ray's a creep, stabbed him and I ran. Well, I can imagine he'd be pissed. That's got nothing to do with me. See, I did get some information from Ray. He said about how you betrayed my dad. You got him caught. He trusted you. That's not how it happened. See, I thought so too, but then it all kind of makes sense. You see, my dad gets caught. You get to take the money and retire. Listen. He got greedy and sloppy. Then he got caught. I don't think it's going to take Ray too long to find me here. I don't think he'd be pleased to see you're helping me. So, Dover? Wow, you look rough. <laughs> what time did you stay till? It's too late. Do you want to grab some food? Food? I can't even look at food right now. I just need my bed. <laughs> too bad we've got a lecture at 11. You've already missed one. Oh, you're loving this, aren't you? <laughs> Only a lot. How do people actually do this? What do you mean? Drinking. I've got to go out again tonight and I feel about 70. <laughs> Has Justin spoken to you yet? No, why? In your state last night, you expressed a deep love for him and requested, and I quote, that he give you a baby in the kitchen. No, <laughs> Justin, I don't believe you. <laughs> Fucking hell! I mean, he's cute, but I don't like him that much. Not as much as that suggests. <laughs> There's more. More? Justin didn't show up this morning either, so everyone's kind of just assuming he's with you. Where are you going? Back home. I'm definitely not going to class now. <laughs> How do you feel about speaking to the jury? I have to, don't I? You don't have to do anything you don't want to. If I don't, there's a chance he'll walk free. Tell me honestly. Well, your statement may not seal the conviction, but we will need a full testimony from you. Will he be there? Yes, the defendant will be there. How can they call him a defendant? And what he did was indefensible. I can try to arrange for a video link so you can do it that way and you don't have to see him. No, I have to be there. I have to look him in the face when I tell him what he's done to my life. The world needs to know what kind of man he is. Okay, Jenny, this is gonna be the hardest thing you've ever had to do. His defense will rip your story to pieces. They're gonna ask you questions that are gonna make you feel beyond uncomfortable. We have a lot of work to do, but I am gonna make sure that you're ready for those questions. How can you do it? And cut. Pretty good. Pretty darn good.